Well, big allegations tonight by a candidate for Indiana State Representative. New at 6, the state elective division is now investigating a complaint filed by Democrat David Colby against GOP opponent Kurt Nicely. The Elkhart County clerk and Nicely's wife are also implicated in that complaint. Kelly Stopsinski is looking into, us, into this for us tonight. Kelly, Colby and Nicely are squaring off in the 22nd district. Jennifer, I want to give you an idea of where that is. You can see South Bend, Elkhart. The 22nd district is this area right here. Most of Kosciuszko County. County and part of Elkhart County. And this complaint, though, stems from the Elkhart County Clerk's website. You can see that right here. It was designed by a company, you can see at the bottom here if I scroll down, named SeaTech Solutions, a company Kurt Nisley owns. Democrat David Colby says the website for the Elkhart County Clerk and the Election Board gives his Republican opponent, Kurt Nisley, an unfair advantage in the race. He also claims Nisley may have access to voter information. One of my campaign team um, became aware of this and brought it to uh, my attention. We weren't actively out there beating the bushes for this kind of thing, believe me. Colby believes Nisley has access to the website because it may be on a different server from the county's official website. The concern? The county's recent switch to vote centers. In the complaint filed Monday, Colby claims Nisley can then access the IP addresses of possible voters who visited the site looking for information on their registration status and where they can vote. These IP addresses can be used to find the physical addresses of those potential voters. Target mailings can then be sent or door-to-door -door visits planned. We don't know that to be true. We express that concern and people smarter than us can investigate forensically if they wish uh, whether that occurred. Colby also says the fact that Nisley's company was selected to design the clerk and election board site is a conflict of interest. County clerk Wendy training. Hudson is a Republican and sits on the county election board. Nisley's wife Mary is the board's Republican chair. Colby's complaint also alleges until August 13th, the CTEC Solutions logo at the bottom of the page linked directly to CTEC's homepage and Nisley's campaign information. I spoke with Nisley today on the phone. He did not want to do an interview, but said there is so much wrong with the complaint. I'm not even going to start addressing it. It's far-fetched. It's laughable. He needs some press. Elkhart County Clerk Wendy Hudson told me she has not yet seen the complaint and is at the National Election Center conference, so she said she's unable to comment. The Election Division in Indianapolis says its legal team is investigating this, but it's up to the Election Commission and its chair to decide if they will hold a hearing and investigate further. I'm Kelly Stopsinski, WSBT Channel 22 News.